Hey y'all, welcome to Slay the Spire. Today we're going to play the daily challenge for June 23rd, 2018. The character is the silent and the modifiers are diverse. Cards are not restricted by a character. Time dilation, all enemies start with a slow debuff that incentivizes playing non-attack cards first. And hoarder, whenever you add a card to your deck, add two additional copies. You can no longer remove cards from your deck at the merchant. So... We see some high scores, even though it's somewhat early. Um, I think the hoarder will give you a lot of, a lot of bonuses. <clears throat> All right, let's see. Maximizing elites. Let us. I see a three elite path, which has to hit this elite. Meaning these two question. Actually, I guess it doesn't matter. Let's go this way. <clears throat> All right. So um, we are. Probably going to well, it's it's a really good. It, it really depends since we don't have any restrictions on cards. We're incentivized to play uh, well to to really build our deck once we get it. So let's just see what we get. And then because of the slow debuff, we are incentivized to first play defense and then play attacks. Actually, oh um, look at that channel. Huh? I don't know. You can channel things. I guess you can. Um. I, I find it too weird to mix the silent with chat. I've never done that before. I, I am I am a little skeptical. Let's see. Sweeping Beam is nice. And Swarp Boomerang only if we have some sort of strength generation, which I don't think we do. Um, let's, let's take Sweeping Beam. AoE might become important here. Um, here I am thinking of actually taking a curse. That way we can improve our modifier by having five curses total. Um, all right, and we got the ancient tea set. Whenever we enter a rest site, we will get two energy in the next place. All right, here we got some gold. All right, and so at the end of the, actually, we can discard this guy. Yes, we should. Okay. Then we don't even have to read what it does. Um, let's actually first play this, and then, um, yeah, both are fully defended, so I'll just do this. I'm a little nervous about the lead. Um, all right, this should kill. Perfect. Ooh, we're getting a lot of uh, defect cards here. Um, this is actually not a bad idea. We both get block and energy for the next turn. Um, yeah, let's do that. All right. So here we'll do this. Defend fully. Neutralize and then sweeping beam. I was hoping to get the curse so that we don't have to deal with it next turn, but that didn't happen. Now we have to deal with it now. Uh, so we're gonna lose one HP for each card in our hand. So let's try to get rid of all the cards. We lost one HP. Oh, I forgot. Thanks to the hoarder, we got three curses. All right, never mind then. I thought I, I just didn't think of that. I mean, it's fine. It gets us closer to our goal of actually getting uh, the Cursus modifier. Um, yeah. I, I, I'm not complaining. This is fine. I mean, I could have gotten a slightly better curse, but it's fine. It's not a big deal. Here, I, I made a mistake. I should have played all cards. There's no reason not to. All right. Um, now, dash is something more... What I'm more familiar with. Um... Let's take Dash. It's a value pick. We have an Elite coming up and we do want to be ideally perfecting it. Alright, the slow debuff is not active on these because they all had artifact armor. So let's see what we can draw. Ooh, we will not be defended if I play this though. I am thinking of playing the energy. That way we also take less damage from the um, regret. Alright, there's the Dash. That would have been useful a little sooner. But, so we're still fully defended. <clears throat> Alright, now this might be more difficult. Alright, dash will give us some defense. Now here we would need an energy potion. Yeah, I don't think we can... Um, yeah, I don't think we can do anything here. Alright, unfortunately we'll be able to perfect this fight. But hopefully the other ones. Oh, and I also forget, all the cards I picked up, they have been duplicated. So really what we're looking for is a Mind Blast. That way we're, we would be already getting 24 damage 
Especially if we upgrade it on the first turn. Um, let's get rid of this guy. And um, it's this 10 damage. I think we can try to kill this one. That we don't have to deal with it next turn. Let's try to get it closer to not having to deal with it. Um, Alright. And then some energy for next turn. I do think we should try to remove uh, one of the curses because we only need five for the modifier, so we don't need. Um, well, ideally. Oh, actually, never mind. Do it all. For each curse in your deck, you start combat with one additional strength. So now <laughs> we're gonna keep those curses. Nay, we're gonna get more. Alright, double your energy. This might not be a bad idea. Um, I don't. Well, actually, let's take it. We got three copies again. Alright, so we are getting 12 incoming damage. We can double our energy. Uh, we can also pretty much attack everybody together. Uh, we can defend against one. Actually, we can kill this guy and get energy for next turn. Perfect. I think we're close. Oh, we are weakened, though. Let's see. Yep, we can kill. Alright, so uh, Storm. Well, that's those two are very specific. I don't think we'll need that. Noxious Fumes. No, no, we have strength. I think we should go for um, sort of small attacks um, that can benefit from our strength a lot. Alright, actually, let's double energy and double energy again. Um, let's do the attack at the end. I do want to draw a card. Some more defend, and we can kill, right? Yeah. We are still taking damage. The, the curses are actually going to be our main source of damage, unfortunately. Oh, we killed. Never mind. I was looking at the HP. Alright, Meteor Strike. Um, oof. Well, we don't have actually any way of getting rid of the Plasma, so that seems unnecessary. The Heavy Blade is actually going to be great, because already um, we will have, what, 20, 23? Um, and hopefully we'll pick up more curses. Actually, I am gonna pick these question marks to pick as many curses as we can get. Happy Flower. Um, every three turns we'll get one energy. Alright, um, let's double. Let's get a bunch of energy for next turn and attack. Alright, so here we'll weaken. Sweeping Beam. One more Sweeping Beam. This does 23. Let's do one more speed, so we can be. Alright, let's just do 23. Perfect. Oh, and the slow slow debuff actually made us um, be able to kill. So pair up on pickup, we get 10 extra HP. I am thinking the, uh, the friend Fiend Fire, because that way we can exhaust all of our curses. Yeah, let's do it. Three copies, why not? Alright, give me curses. Never mind, it gave me enemies. Um, hmm. And all of them are attacking. Great. Exactly what I wanted. Um, Alright, let's get some energy for next turn. Uh, we can definitely kill one of them. Um, I do believe it's probably better if we attack. Let's attack the strongest one. Why not? We're actually fully defended. Alright. Uh, we can play the Fiend Fire, which is fine though. Let's kill this guy as well. Alright. I want to kill this guy because otherwise he'll give us um, weakness. That's something I would like to avoid. So here's our... Actually, uh, let's play the AoE at the end. Actually, no. We can we can just play attack cards. There we go. I overthought it. Alright. Add a random power hand to your, car, uh, to your power card to your hand. It costs zero this turn. That seems... Well, it may give us a lot of unnecessary and useless powers. Uh, this is actually great because we have uh, three strengths. So that's 30 damage right off the bat. Yep. And again, I'm hoping for more curses. So here, let's um, double our energy, get rid of the regret, and then play this, play this, and now this will give up only... Oh, 40 damage. Perfect. Alright, I think the Duvudal is a great pick, or was a lucky break for us. Um, I don't think I need any of this. Alright, let's see if we can perfect this lead. Oof. Off to a bad start. Um, Alright, let's double the energy. 
So we have six. Play the defense cards first. Um, so this will do 30 damage. And this will do 23. So we can kill one of them. Actually, what we can do is... Let's make this guy vulnerable. That way we can kill um, with this card. And then we can already weaken this one. So hopefully we'll have some uh, way of killing one and defending against, against the other in the next turn. Alright, so. Yep, this is it. Alright, we're perfecting. So far so good. Um, this actually kills, right? Perfect. Alright, first perfection. Penip, every 10th attack we double our attack strength. And in here, I think I'll take escape plan. Um, that way we'll, we'll cycle through our deck a little faster and it does have a useful thing. Oh, uh, perfect, a shop. We have, hmm, let's see. A lot of cards to choose from. Um, trip might be interesting. I am thinking of Shuriken because we do definitely play a lot of attacks. Let's play Shuriken and then we still have enough for the trip. Let's do it. Alright, um, who's our boss here? Yeah, that might be difficult. Oof, I am undecided. Um, no, I think we'll smith here. Let us smith a... Oof, I don't really know what. So many options. Um, let's smith a neutralize. Yeah, I, I can't really make up my mind on anything else. Let's smith a neutralize. The other option, I think next we'll smith the heavy blades. Because, um, that'll increase our attack damage a little bit. Alright, uh, I kind of want to just fiend fire everything, right? Um... Let's double our energy. Play Heavy Blade. Twice. Um, yeah. Let's play Dash and then Fiend Fire. Oh, we did increase our strength thanks to playing three attacks. Alright, unfortunately now um, we'll get damage if we attack without any defense. And unfortunately, we wouldn't have any defense. This is unfortunate. And I said unfortunate twice already. Um. Yeah, I think... It's a 60 damage right there. I think we'll have to do it. I mean, yeah, we can't perfect this fight anymore, so... Very sad. Um, Alright, double energy. Double energy again. Draw a card. Trip. Defend. Making all this... Drawing energy somewhat useless. Alright, so here we'll do 50 damage, followed by another 39, which kills. Oh, I forgot the. Never mind, it still kills. Yeah, sad that we weren't able to perfect. This This um, boss is generally very difficult to um, perfect against. Um, none of these things. Oof. We were kind of looking for energy or relics. We didn't get any. Um, I wonder if we should astrolabe, but then we'll get nine extra cards and they might be garbage. Let's go with the Black Star. That way we may uh, receive the modifier for having more than 29, uh, 25 relics. Oh, and our Penib is active on the next turn. Uh, all right, I do want to hit a shop maybe. Let's see. So there's one elite on the left. Unfortunately, I only see a two elite path. Yeah, but this path um, does have a few question marks, which is a good sign. Let's go this way, that way we'll hit the shop as well. Alright, so next attack is doubled. Um, I don't have a good attack in my hand. That is unfortunate. Alright, so let's double energy. Let's see what we get. Alright, perfect. This might kill actually, right? That's 23 times 5, 125. There we go. Penib to the rescue. Um, we don't want this. Actually, I don't think we want any of this. Maybe the Piercing Whale, but no. Alright, here. Dagger Spray for sure. Let's see if there's anything else. Um, yeah, not really. Let's do the Dagger Spray. Alright, remove a card. Um, let's remove one of the Curses. Again, because if, if we get another curse event, we will be able to um, get the curse modifier. 
Uh, it does decrease our strength a little bit, but that that curse is a little annoying. Um, yeah, let's keep going. All right, double energy. Play this, and then this should kill. All right. Um, so it really depends on what we draw on our first turn. Um, let's get them prepared. That way we can sort of optimize our hand. We got unlucky. All right. Oh, actually, let's find the curse here. There's fiend fire there. Neutralize there. I wouldn't mind another. Oh, there we go. There's pain. Oof. All right. I don't want to gamble. I'll take another fiend fire. That way we'll also get the modifier for having four of that one card. Unfortunately, we did get that. We didn't get that energy or uh, the curse. I mean. All right. Let's draw a card. Trip. Trip this guy. Um. Dagger spray for sure. Uh, we cannot. Oh, we. You know what? Drinking the disturbed potion will allow us to defend. Otherwise, we will not be able to. We would have 17 rather than 18. Um, here, I think I'll just fiend fire, right? Um, let's defend and fiend fire. All right. Let's see. Heavy blade. This does 30, this does 23, so that's 53. Um, almost enough. Um, let's drop, actually... Well, let's drop both. Let's try again. Yep, I think this is enough. Perfect. Alright, we got Matryoshka. The next two chests contain two relics and Kunai. Every time you play three attacks, you gain one dexterity. Um, none of these. Thanks. Alright, let's see. This way. Alright, double energy. I don't want to exhaust everything, but um, let's actually set up attack for, or energy for next turn, as well as get the pendant activated on double energy, and... I don't think we can penetrate 30 armor. I probably should have. Well, yeah, I couldn't do it anyway. But this should kill. This should kill. Never mind. This should kill. There we go. Third time's the charm. All right, Anthropic Brew, which will fill all of our potion slots. So as soon as we're ready to get the rid of the um, ancient potion, we'll do that. I will take a thunderclap. It's a nice way to get vulnerability vulnerability in the same turn. Um, Smith. I think I will smith the heavy blades just because they are a um, good way of pushing a lot of attacks out. And I'm still hoping for a curse soon. So, Vatra at the start of each combat gain one strength as well as Neko Skull, which will get extra poison, but we don't have any poison generation. All right, so here I think Fiendfire is one, two, three, four, five, six cards. So that 60 damage will kill this guy. Do it. Easy. Don't have to think about it for too long. And this is 40 damage. Perfect. Yep, we're basically at this point relying on just the Fiendfires. Um, I don't think we'll want any of these. I was considering the armaments, um, but yeah. All right, another fiend fire. Draw, see what we get. Another thunderclap. Hmm. So, how much damage will we get here? Fifty plus whatever. Yeah, there's no reason to lose HP. Um, actually, we can also. Yeah, let's just do it. Usually it's better to kill the frontliner because otherwise now he'll start um, buffing up every single turn. But I think we should be fine with another fiend fire. We don't need two in the same hand. Draw one card. And actually let's defend. I could have used the dexterity, a speed potion because I rarely use it otherwise. Um, here let's draw a card. Riddle with holes twice, why not? 30 damage here, and 70 damage here. Rage is nice. Um, yeah, I'll give us cheap... Nah, nah, let's not, let's not. I think we have enough defense, and we already have enough cards. I was hoping for a Mind Blast, but we didn't get that. Um, 
Yeah, I don't see any cards that we like here. The Master of Strategy might be nice, but it does cost a lot, so I think instead we might want to take a Relic. Actually, let's save our gold. On the next, next floor, we can buy things. Still no sign of the second curse that I was hoping for. Let's draw a card. Um, so we only have enough. Here, let's play the Dagger Spray. And then let's do the... F oh, I guess we're not fully defended. We're receiving 24 incoming damage. Um, we could defend for another 10, which gives us 13. Hmm. Uh, let's actually drink these and see what we get here. Okay, Ghost in a Jar, which actually is nice. Do that. That way we only have 3 incoming damage, so then we can, without thinking about it, do 50 damage on this guy. Alright. Alright. Okay, so um, let's double our energy. We can um, Thunderclap. Get 15 block. Oh, I guess I didn't realize our artifact armor allowed us to keep the 5 increase in dexterity. I hadn't even thought of that. Which is great because we're still perfecting this fight. And we're gone. Alright, uh, Twin Strike. That's 14 damage. Why not? This, this is very dependent on what we draw. Let's actually not double our energy because I don't think we need it. Maybe double it once. Okay, so we draw another card. Dagger Spray. And Fiendfire. We don't have any defense though. I think if we should take the Sneko Eye. What could we draw that might be useful? I don't think there's anything. We we, we cannot. Well, I mean, we didn't get lucky with any defense cards in our opening hand, so I don't think there's a, a big point. This kills, though. Alright, Strawberry, you increase your max HP. We can pick a card. I don't think... Actually, we'll take the Thunderclap and Whetstone, which will upgrade two random cards. I picked the Thunderclap to um, get the bonus for having duplicates of those cards as well. I think we'll continue with upgrading the Heavy Blades. I don't think there's any other card that I immediately need to upgrade. Alright, so. Trip, Vulnerable, Vulnerable, Dagger Spray, Strike, and... I guess there was no way I could have defended, I just realized. So this will only do 7 damage and we still only have 6. I'm trying to think if I should just the Sneko Oil. I mean, we're not perfecting at this point anyway. I think I'm going to use the Sneko Oil and hope to get something that will allow me to defend, which I didn't. So, yep. No way I can defend. And now I pretty sure risked everything by making myself confused. Um, Alright, let's draw. Yep. Uh, that's a useful, useless doubling of energy. Um, let's draw one more time. Perfect. So next turn he's gonna, or the turn after he's gonna debuff. Um, let's do 18 damage. Why not? And we got our penny back there. So if we get, we get a riddle with holds, we did not. We did get a fiend fire. So this is 117 damage, whereas this is 36 times four, which is a little more than 117. Uh, let's do it. This would give us a modifier of attacking for over 100, but I think we can probably do that another time. Alright, and then the skills. Okay, unfortunately we are doing well, but we're not perfecting as many fights as I was hoping. Get another fiend fire. Alright, so here... I think we have to take the Busted Crown, we really need energy. Well, sometimes we need a lot of energy. <clears throat> Alright, let's see. So, one, two... I see a three elite path. Actually, two three elites path. So, let's, let me look at the question marks because we want to maximize those. Okay, and there's a late shop right here. So, um, I only see the ability of hitting two question... Actually, three. Never mind. We'll go this way. 
Alright, so we really need cursors to somewhat justify... I should have doubled first. To somewhat justify our um, taking cursors at the beginning. Alright, power potion. I don't think we need the explosive potion that much. Talisize. Um, I... 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 Uh, it might help us perfect fights. Let's take it. Alright, so we definitely want to take the fruit juice. But I don't think we need anything else. Alright, there we go. So now we have... Um, five curses. And also five strength. Unfortunately, our opening hand is going to suffer. But, thanks to Fiendfire, we should be fine. Um, let me attack the... Strongest one here. Alright, so double our energy, thunderclap, um, and then fiend fire will do 26, or uh, 46, sorry, so that's barely enough for this guy. Let's do it. I also realized I never drank my fruit juice. Also, see what the skill potion does. Oh, perfect. Weak and defense. Fully defended. That's a good skill potion. Also, we can raise our max HP by max HP by a little more. That would be great. Um, 28 damage. Plus fully defended. So this kills and this kills. Perfect. Um, cleave. No, I think we have good AoE. We don't need more. Alright, I'm getting really lucky by getting Fiendfire both times in the opening hand. Uh, so we can... Hang on, how much is this? 15, we need 60. Or 13, sorry, we need 60. Yeah, it's going to be a little hard. Um, let's get rid of you, and then attack you. Alright. So far, so good. So now the Metallicize... Hmm... Play Metallicize. Let's play Dash. Um, and then we can kill. Actually, that's 50 damage. Yeah, we can... Actually, no, we have to pick. Let's kill this guy first. Um, let's get some defense. Actually, drop these two. Okay, let's defend. And then vulnerability. Oof. I'm gonna get some damage, so I'm just gonna attack once. Um ah, let's just do it. Alright, we don't need this. Okay, first I'll lead on third floor. Let's try to win this. Um we get them some defense, we can double our energy. Thunderclap. Yep, doesn't look good. I mean, we can kill one, but we won't be able to defend against the other one. Now, if we had something like the Unseizing Top, that would be pretty neat. Little energy, Thunderstrike. Oh, yeah, we're not at all defending against this. Yeah, I think our deck has too many attack cards and not enough defense cards. So if we can't kill... Oh, actually, whenever you discard a card during your turn... Gain 3 block, and whenever you add an attack to your card, uh, it is upgraded. Um, we don't play that many attacks, actually. Let's take it, why not? It is an attack. Alright, here... Yeah, I really don't know what to upgrade. Um, let's just continue upgrading the Heavy Blade. Maybe we can continue upgrading the um, Double Energy later, because we do use that once in a while. I want to fight this. Fire again. Um, let's see what else we get. Yeah, we don't need two, and we don't need this. Okay. I don't know why I could. I should have discarded the curses. That was dumb. Um, let's attack. So let's kill one of you, and let's exhaust the rest. All right. Thunderclap. Sweeping it. Oh, there we go. 
calipers. Uh, at the start of your turn, lose 15 block rather than all. Um, yeah, we have to go this way. Bag of Marbles at the beginning of each card, uh, apply vulnerable to all enemies. And I think I will take a Fiend Fire in the opening hand. That way we can guarantee that we can burn all out of uh, burn all of the um, curses out. Like so. Um, let's first draw a card. Ooh, not bad. Let's do Thunderclap. Um, we can play both, actually. Unfortunately, I was hoping to activate the Pendip, but unfortunately we have to do it this way. Alright, now it's active on the next turn. Um, it's 29 times 4. That's unfortunately not enough. Right, let's double the energy, play this. Let's see what we get here. Okay, escape plan. We want to keep that. Let's get rid of the Fiend Fire. Alright. Unfortunately, that was not a great use of our Pendip. Um, let's get rid of you. And we can just defend this way. Alright, almost there. Okay, Rage. Yeah, we should take this. I think if we had it before, we might have been able to perfect some of the fights. And it is a zero-cost card. Um, so let's do Thunder. Yeah, it's unfortunate that they're attacking this turn, because we just cannot defend against it. And we don't have anything good to be able to defend. How many relics do we have, by the way? That's 10, 15, 20. Yeah, we need quite a few still. Um, we have four energy, so let's play this, this, and then this. Um, I think we can vulnerability, heavy blade, and fiend fire. All right. Um, escape plan, double energy, palisades, thunderclap. Mostly the double energy to increase the slow debuff. Alright, those kills. Alright, we got the potion meld, which increases the number of potions we can have, as well as the regal pillar, which increases the number, uh, the amount that we heal, as well as a heavy blade, and let's spend all of our money here. Let me see, so we have 5, 10, 15, 20. We need 3 more. And we have 1 elite, which will give us 2, so we just need 1 more. Um... Blue Candle is nice, we can play uh, Curses. Um, Singing Bowl is coming a little too late, Bronze Scales might be useful. I don't, oh, actually, we definitely want to take this for the score modifier. And I um, guess we have enough for two. Fortunately not for... Actually, yeah, we can take any of these. Um, let us take this and this, All right? We can't buy anything else, right? Yep. Okay. Alright, so let's see what this guy gives us. Oh, when did our health get this low? I did not notice that. Wow. Uh, that is a little concerning. Oh, that is actually very concerning. Are we dead? Uh, yeah, I think we're dead. Wow. I I was not looking. I the, the, Wow, I, I, I'll check the replay, but... The previous um, boss month must have given us a number. Wow, I I was that was just pure inattentiveness on my end. We were doing well. We had four collectors and two completion. Yeah, wow, that was just a brain fart. Um, I don't know how to explain it. This was, I think, a good run. If um, I think if we if we had looked out for our health a little better, maybe bought some potions, um, that would have been much better. Uh, oh well. Yeah, I can definitely see us getting to the thousands, especially if we had perfected some of the bosses earlier on. But anyway, I guess that's it for today. After such a great run yesterday, now this. Oh well. See you all tomorrow. Bye.